the Center for Democracy and Development CDD has joined added its voice to the call on President Mohamed Buhari to sign into law the Electoral Bill 2021, saying such will represent the most significant legacy of his presidency. CDD a pro-democracy policy and research think tank said the proposals in the electoral bill 2021 will truly improve the country's electoral system and the political party's candidate selection process according to the group with the successful integration of technology into the electoral process, legal backing for electronic voting and transmission of election results will aid President Buhari in improving Nigeria's election. This will surely be President Buhari's legacy for Nigerian people, it's noted. In a statement signed by its director, Idiyat Hassan, the center said, The next critical step that must be taken is for the assenting into law, the Electoral Bill 2021 particularly, as we add to two off-circle elections in Ekiti and Ocean States in 2022 and the 2023 general elections. The Senate had on October 13, 2021, re amended certain aspects of the Electoral Amendment Bill contained in Clause 43, 52, 63, and 87, respectively. The re amendment to the clauses followed a motion. For re committal moved by Senator Yahya Abdullahi. According to CDD, the new electoral bill contains provisions that seek to improve the electoral system, including the process of voting, coalition, and announcement of results, and most importantly, help address. The lack of public confidence in the process. It noted that the direct primary method for candidate selection proposed in the bill will improve internal party democracy by strengthening party move in you know, party membership, and then that poor internal processes are largely responsible for the weakness of political parties in Nigeria and have an adverse effect on the country's governance system. With the direct primary election, every registered method of the party will directly determine their candidates, the CDD said. This, it said, will reduce the floodgates of litigation that usually trail the idea of consensus or imposition of candidates by political godfathers and party owners. When signed into law, the Electoral Bill will now effectively return the electoral power to the original custodian, the people, in accordance with the dictates of democracy, CDD noted, adding that unlike before, the citizens would now be positioned as the decider of who represents you know, the decider, pardon, of who represents their political party and interest in the election instead of the status quo. As a keen watcher of the Nigerian political space. We have followed the entire process from the beginning to this point, 
from submission of memoranda to technical review, retreats, and extensive deliberation of all stakeholders, including contributions from critical stakeholders like the INEC, Independent National Electoral Commission, to political parties, civil society organizations, and youth groups. CDD therefore urged President Buhari to sign, you know, to sign the bill and write his name in the golden place of history. What is your thoughts to this? What is your own reaction to this pen development we've just had? The Center for Democracy and Development has joined added its voice to the call on President Muhammad Buhari to sign into law the Electoral Bill 2021 saying such will represent the most significant legacy of his presidency. Sign Electoral Bill to write your name in golden letters. That is what the group have told President Muhammad Buhari. What is your thoughts to this? A pro-democratic, you know, a policy and a research think tank is what the CDD represents and it said the proposal in the Electoral Bill 2021 will truly improve the country's electoral system. We would like you to share those with us via the comment section on this. But before we go, let's see people's reactions and know their thoughts to this. Let's see what people have felt concerning the institution of things in Nigeria. Arinzi Chuku Chukuma reacted to this and said, Buhari really did not make a good name for himself. History will not be very fair to him. He will be remembered in my house as an evil man who sent soldiers to kill my brother for holding a Biafran flag. Even the northern parts won't remember him for any good work. What is your thoughts to this? What is your own reaction to this plan development? Obina Lion also reacted and said, Only thing that will salvage is already dead name or beat is he he signs himself out of that position. Buhari is nothing but an imbecilic president. What is your thoughts to this? We've had different reactions from people saying that. According to Chukuma said, Buhari has not, you know, really make a good name for himself. So even if he signed it into law, that doesn't change anything. While Obina made a suggestion that the only thing that will salvage his already dead name is for him to sign himself out of that position as the president. What is your thoughts to this? Signing the electoral bill won't change anything. It won't change all the evil Buhari has committed against humanity. That is what Olaide Ade have said. We would like you to let us know your own reaction to this. Don't forget that. Sign electoral bill to write your name in good letters. That is what the CDD group have told Buhari of which people have condemned. We would like you to share those with us via the comment section. We would like you to let us know your own reaction to this. Thank you guys for listening. Do subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.